When discussing sensitive skin, I really like to distinguish between sensitive skin as a primary skin disease for, what, for when you have nothing else. So a patient who says, my skin stings, burns, anything I put on it hurts, but they don't have rosacea, they don't have eczema, they don't have acne, they don't have anything. So there's primary sensitive skin, and then there's secondary sensitive skin resulting from a primary skin disease or some underlying disorder that leads to barrier dysfunction. So I think it's important to distinguish between the two.